to my channel and if you're new, hey what's up? My name is Tanya and thank you all so much for joining in and watching this video. As usual, there will be timestamps listed down below so you can jump around and if you like what you see, smash that subscribe button, hit that notification bell. You want to be a part of the Fawn Squad and you don't want to miss out when I upload new videos and just hit that like button to, to spread the love around. We all want to grow together. It's really exciting. So just, you know, it's just, it's right here. It's, it's so easy to just click, 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 click. And we have such a strong, amazing, empowering group of people on this channel. So you're truly missing out if you don't join in on the comments and get to know everybody. And I try to post seven days a week, sometimes a couple of times a day. I'm trying to stay up on your releases all of the time. And you just don't want to miss out on the content and the fun. So there's like, why are you hesitating? Just, just stop hesitating. Okay, now this video shout out goes to Samantha Perdue. Samantha, thank you so much for wishing my hubby a happy birthday. That was so sweet of you. And thank you so much for subscribing and becoming a part of the Fawn fam, Fawn squad, Fawn community. It is so awesome to have you be a part of the Fawn squad. So I just had to give you a shout out because I'm going through my comments all the time trying to like pick names and it's so difficult and I was like oh she wished Kurt a happy birthday that was so sweet so see this is just so awesome it's such a great I love it and it, we're about to go out for dinner and when I'm done wrapping up these little videos so uh, my intros I should say <laughs> which technically are little videos oh my god I'm so like a spaz and all over the place today I apologize but Samantha I just wish that <laughs> see I can't even talk Samantha, I wish that we could give you a hug, cheers, celebrate, have a little dance, go out, it's Saturday night, it's perfect, you know, just the usual, but at least I have some really fun, festive uh, birthday makeup on, so that's always cool. Alright, now this video is on two products from Guerlain. They have released, I believe these are both limited edition, though it did not say it on the package. I did get both of mine off of Sephora, though. So the Guerlain blush, this has a heart shape and then it's comprised of little hearts within it and then there are a couple metallic hearts in there and inside you have one part matte blush and then all those other three are luminizers but it is the most faint but beautiful blush but I do think at the end of the day this would be more of a collector's item because it is expensive it's Guerlain and I mean you can smell the luxury like you can just you know you just smell like yeah <laughs> but it's so pretty so I do think that it's definitely not a necessary blush to have in your collection or not a necessary blush to have if you're a collector I think you would be really sad to not have this because in person when you're looking at the fine details this is beautiful and it does give the most light pink oh my eye and when you swirl the brush around in there and you get that luminosity building up, it is just so pretty and natural and not overpowering. It's kind of like a nudie pink. I'm wearing the lipstick right now too, so it's like a really natural light pink color. So it's just, this. these two items are really almost like bridal, ethereal. I think it's perfect timing as the bridal season will be approaching us. And if you are going to be a bride, I even think that this would be worthwhile having just to have it photographed before your forever photos because I mean, you have to like pink, but if you like pink, this has your hearts, it's pink, and this will be something that will be beautiful for your photographer to take a picture of if you have it out, whether or not you're doing your makeup, a friend is, a makeup artist is, just to have this be included in your wedding photos, I think is something to think about. You know, just, it really is stunning. Um, it just glides on so smoothly and you can build it up and build it up and build it up. And I do demo it and I do lip swatch this so you can see it 
from my lip color to what this becomes as well. Now, I don't think the camera is picking this up, but I could be mistaken once I get to editing. This has such a pearlescent sheen to it. It is beautiful. It literally looks like a pearl. It is unreal, the color of it. And then the lipstick, again, I've used it though. So you, with use, it's definitely going to lose that little heart shape, but it is a heart shape. And it says, kiss, kiss, love, love. So again, this would be something really beautiful to be photographed if you're having, for your wedding day too, because it's just, just stunning. And the shade is called Kiss Kiss 573, hashtag KK Heart Pink. <laughs> so I think that, again, it's not necessary. It's just that these are beautiful collector's pieces. So I did want to bring them to your attention. I obviously collect makeup. I love Girl On. It's pink. It has hearts. It had my name written all over it. And because I do put so much thought into weddings and planning events and that kind of a thing, I also wanted to bring that to like awareness for any brides to be out there for this upcoming season. And congratulations to any future brides because this is something that if this was would have been around when Kurt and I got married, I would have wanted to have this and have it photographed because it's just so pretty. But I I'm very much attention to detail, so that's where my brain goes. And at the end of the day, they're beautiful products too. So if you guys want to see uh, it in action and the lip swatching, then just keep on watching. All right, here's the Golan Perry Meteorite Heart Shape. It just says Meteorite Heart Shape, <laughs> but it is a strobing palette blush and luminizer powder. I want to say that this is limited edition, but I can't remember now. I did get this off of Sephora's website, but it is not saying anything about being limited edition on the packaging, so maybe it's not. Uh, so this... Um, yeah, I'm confused about that. Okay, so I will have to double check if that is limited or edition or not. It is 10 grams or 0.3 ounces. And then at the end of this video, once I'm actually done my makeup, I also picked up, they had this Kiss Kiss Creamy Share. I have makeup on it already, shaping. <laughs> Creamy Shaping Lip Color in the shade 573, hashtag KK Heart Pink. <laughs> that is so cute. So I'm going to do a lip swatch of this baby at the end as well. I'm gonna leave that out so I don't forget, but right now it's time for me to blush and then do bronze, highlight and then do my lower lash line so we're gonna do blush right now of course it's bougie so it needs to have its own little sleeve oh my god that's so pretty oh I know grandma fawn is dying over that right now and I don't know if you guys are gonna be able to see it up close it's actually a shape of a heart made out of hearts and then there's extra metallic hearts Can you guys see that? Hold it there for a second so hopefully you can make it out. Maybe, and then maybe back here. Oh my gosh, those couple of metallic hearts are so popping. That is the coolest packaging. I really do think that this is limited edition. It's so beautiful. Oh, okay, let's see what the product looks like. Oh. That's beautiful. So this is, you know, a coral pink, and then that's a luminous pink, and then a luminous as well. So let's see. Yeah, we're gonna be mixing these babies all together. Blushes never really, yeah, swatch well at all. And it does show you like a little face design in there if you really wanted to properly oh my gosh there you go uh do it with this image i'm so sorry you guys i don't know how to catch it without blinding you guys with beauty lights but it does have that insert oh that's on the mirror i don't think that that's removable actually 
All right, well, let's just see what this is all about. I'm, I cannot talk today. I swear, every video I've been filming, I'm just can't talk. Okay, my It Cosmetics Heavenly Lux Flawless Blush Brush. I'm going to swirl her all around. Get a nice coat, and then I'm not even gonna tap it off because this is so faint and a nudie pink. I'm just going for it. I'm very happy I did not tap it off. <laughs> okay, let's go in there. Maybe it needs like a little, you know, to get it going. It smells nice. Oh, there we go. We're getting a light luminous flush of color and it is really pretty in person. Very faint, but really pretty. Oh, I love that sheen in the blush. Okay, so when you guys do get it, it kind of needs, this isn't even that hard of a brush. I kind of want to take a brush that's a little bit more coarse and dense just to get this really like moving, which saddens me, but there we go. That should do it. Sometimes you just need to work that top layer off. Okay, now let's see. Oh, you know what? This might be the time to put my Lime Crime blush brush to the use because it's a more, much more dense brush. Nope. <laughs> it just requires a lot of building. Which is really good to have on a day like today when my eyes are, you know, going to be the star of the show. I would just say that this is definitely more for the collector because you can so get these kind of blushes at a much more affordable price point than having to go through all of this. <laughs> but it is very pretty. But you get the same kind of effect from those Ciate blushes without having to go in like this, but I do like it a lot. And I am a collector, so I'd still get it again. And see that like beautiful sheen? So oh, I, keep, I had to get, oh my God, brush off the bake. So it does give you this beautiful sheen. So if you guys aren't into highlighting or you don't have time and you do want like a two in one, this gives it to you. It gives a really beautiful glow to the face. And look at that, even after like scratching it and swirling it, it really maintained each little separate quadrant. Nothing is disrupted, and yes, it's a quadrant because there is an extra, there's a fourth place before anybody tries to come for me because I've had people coming for me lately. <laughs> so it maintained its shape completely, and it gave a really beautiful glowing blush. Heck, this would be beautiful for a bride, actually. And then to have this like out on the vanity for a photographer to be taking pictures of with like the makeup out, this would be so worth it for a bride. So, so worth it. Okay, so I'm gonna go finish up my makeup and then I will be back to do the lip swatch of the other, the lip product. I'm fired today. I'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, so now we can try on the Guerlain Kiss Kiss Rouge, but number 573, hashtag KK Heart Pink. <laughs> I think that this is also limited edition. Ooh, she's pretty. That's like pearlescent. I don't know if the camera is quite going to pick up on that, but it has this pearl 
pink sheen to it. In person, this is so stunning. You have no idea. Oh, it's even a heart shape. Look at how cute that is. Oh, I love it. it smells good too. Yeah, so these are just both really natural, well, I think embracing like your beauty, your pinks, but like better almost. Because this is really stunning. So this is going to be so pretty to add to the collection, but these are wins for sure. This is super nourishing, really comfortable. It's not sticky that glided on effortlessly. It smells good, it feels good, it looks cool, but the color is beautiful. Like, it's really unique. So, if you guys are collectors, I would not sleep on that one. So, that is it for this mini video. Please thumbs it up if you liked it. Please share it. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And until next time, good night, good morning, wherever you are. I love you guys so much, and I will talk to you later. Bye, guys.